At the heart of the Nissan GTR LM Nismo is the engine, which produces around 550 horsepower. The engine itself is designed for 6,000 km life. We then endurance test it to 8,000 km to make sure that we find all the problems that we may see at 6,000. Motul works with Nismo to produce lubricants that will enable the car to reach 100% of its potential. An engine oil is vital to keep an engine running. It will increase power, durability, efficiency, as well as protecting the engine. Le Mans is one of the hardest tracks in the world. Running for 24 hours makes it probably the most difficult race for, for an engine to compete at. At Le Mans, the engine will be running pretty much full throttle for 24 hours. The distance covered is like driving from New York to LA. It's an incredibly big distance in a very short time. The lubricants are vital to enable the car to complete the race. So there's a very thin film of oil that takes all the pressure from the combustion and the only way the engine will survive is by having very high quality lubricants. The first thing lubricants do is improve efficiency, reducing friction and wear by minimizing the metal-to-metal -metal contacts. It's really critical that, that the oils reduce the friction as much as possible. Otherwise, that is all just lost power which goes out of the engine in heat. The lubricant acts as a seal between the piston and the cylinder liner, optimizing the power of the engine. Pistons are very hot. They're running sort of over 300 degrees. Those are the areas really where the highest stress is contained. This is why the lubricant acts as a coolant layer to develop a perfect oil for Le Mans, there are many different characteristics to look at. The main number one characteristic is the viscosity, the fluid's resistance to flow. For each engine, there is a preferred viscosity to reach. If the viscosity is too low, it's going to lead to metal-to-metal -metal contacts and increase damages and wear. This could lead to potential engine failure. If the viscosity is too high, in other words, the oil is too thick, you're gonna need more time and energy to bring the lubricant to the part it is meant to lubricate. If more energy is being used to move the oil around the engine, then that means less fuel economy and less power. The oils have to run um, for the 24 hour race. 24 hours of shearing the components of the oil. The choice of polymer is key. We use these polymers to make sure the oil doesn't run too thin. Other key parameters that the oil will be facing is first oxidation temperature and oil consumption. Typically, the race team will communicate to us vital data. These include oil pressure, oil consumption, and ratings of the mechanical parts. From all this, all this data that's feeding into us, we can determine um, the health of the engine and try and spot if anything is going wrong. Our goal is to give back what we learned during the Super GTs and Le Mans into standard Nismo prepared cars. With the oils Motul have developed, we have helped Nismo win on track since 2003. Hopefully, the oils we've developed for the GTR LM Nismo will be as successful in Le Mans.